guys, my name is Kylie Bologna. Welcome back if you've been here before and welcome if you are new with us. Today we are going to my first ever Pride event. We are going to a Pride garden party at this place called Nam Keg, which is like this beautiful estate with a garden. I've never been there either. So I'm really excited and there's a DJ from Lebane, which is impeccable. I am so excited. Um, however, I have 30 minutes to do my makeup because I have improper planning skills. So, um, let's get going on the makeup. I just figured we'd sit down and, like, have a little makeup day today. Have, like, a little cute moment. Um, and I was planning on, like, getting ready early. Because my sister is never on time for anything. She's always like, let's go a little late. So, obviously, that's what I was assuming for today. And then she just called me and she was like, are you on your way? And I was like... No, I'm not even ready yet. I just got out of the shower. And she was like, we have to get there at four. And I was like, oh, <laughs> like that's crazy. So due to my improper planning skills, I am now behind schedule, which is okay. That's fine. It's not a big deal, but I'm really excited. It's supposed to be like this afternoon. Like it's like literally starts at four, which is so exciting. And it's kind of like this like tea party style vibe. Like, it's like a garden party, so I'm, like, so excited. I am going to rewear my strawberry dress for my birthday, but I don't think anyone there will really notice. I also feel a little nervous because I don't know what I'm doing for my makeup yet, and I, I guess that's okay. Lately, I've been very no makeup makeup, and I, I love that. Also, I know you got I just did this hair, but I love it so much. It gives so much strawberry shortcake vibes. I adore. Going in with the Morphe Jeffree Star palette. And I'm just going to do like a light pink look, I guess. I'm going to start with like this color, which is my, my neck, my back. Um, also, I'm like, oh, I didn't put eyeshadow primer on. Can you guys tell I'm a little flustered today? I'm like, oh, I hate being late. That's like always been my thing. So Courtney always being late has like, you know, it's really done good for me. So for her to be like, okay, we need to be on time, I'm like... And I'm kind of late. I'm like, uh, like I hate being that person. But also, I know I'm not gonna rush myself because I'm going to look good. I'm going to look great. Not that I'm trying to score a girlfriend, but I do like to browse. I love good brows. That's honestly like my favorite part of like being single is you just get to browse and like meet like really incredible, amazing people. And that's so cool. And that's honestly really awesome. Because, like, I feel like, especially in my generation, like, humans just lack connection and, like, communication now. And that's really sad. That's really sad. So, like, I just love to go and talk. Yesterday, I went out for, like, a couple drinks after work. And I talked to this guy about the radio for, like, 45 minutes. And I was like, I love this. Do I know anything about the radio? Not really. But like, I love to yap about it. Yap, 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 yap. After this color, we're gonna go in with back. My back. That's so funny. Honestly, so funny. It's just getting very light. Light pink right now. And then I think we're gonna go in with a little bit of a heavier pink. And then just probably like a soft glitter. And then we're gonna go in with this like bright pink, which is self-made. It's just like beautiful. Kind of hot pinky. I remember when this whole collection launched with Morphe. It was the first time I had ever gone in an Ulta. And my sister worked at like a hairdresser at the time, like a very specific salon where like she couldn't go into like Ulta Beauties because they have salons. And like she snuck in there with me and she bought me this palette and it was like the nicest, like it was just, ha. Ah. My sister is the reason I like makeup and like the things that I do. And that's really awesome. <sighs> I love that. I just like blended it out and like packed the pigment on on that guy. One thing I will say about the Tarte Shape Tape is I always liked this concealer for one thing very specifically. For cut creases, this stuff is like a gold mine. And like back in the day, I don't as much anymore, but back in the day, I used to do a good cut crease like all the time. 2016, Kylie, doing a cut crease like every day. I don't know if you guys have cats, 
But sometimes they really hurt your feelings. And Kenneth just jumped into my vanity and jumped into my palette. They're not like broken, but like they have little cat marks on them. <laughs> oh, my baby. Okay, but we are so late. We're so late. It's like fine. But like, I'm like, we're late. Um, we're gonna go in with two, which is like the soft glittery pink. And I just sprayed my brush with setting spray, so it just packs the like pigment on a little shinier. This is a beautiful color. I can't believe I don't use this more. I like haven't done eyeshadow in a while, but like this color is really nice. It, I feel like I could use this as like a topper for like anything. I added some glitter around the outside too, just to like spice it up. And I'll probably do like glitter on the face. I think we're gonna go in with some light makeup makeup. So I'm gonna go in first with concealer. This is the Tarte Shape Tape again. I do like this. Like it's pretty frequent in my like usage. Blend baby, blend. For semi-rush concealer, Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm gonna go in with the e.l.f. Halo Glow. This is in shade like one, I think, yeah. And this was before they came out with like the half shades and the zero. So like in summer, this color is really nice. In winter, this color is so dark on me. I like this because it is very like no makeup makeup, which is kind of like my vibe lately. And then I just got this brush. This is the It Cosmetics Star Brush, and it's so nice. It just, like, blends everything so well. My makeup is just, like, a lot of blending. I'm like, slather, blend, slather, blend. It's, like, my favorite. Because it just makes it feel a little easier sometimes, too. A setting powder just to go under the concealer and on my chin, because that's where I feel like my makeup falls. I have the Morphe setting powder brush and the Morphe powder. I really, really like them. Well, that sets we are going with bronzer. This is a MAC one that I've had literally forever. And it's called Baby Girl, and it's she's at Pan. Baby Girl is at Pan. Not a huge bronzer girl anymore. So, like, I try to be very sparing. Honestly, I'm so stressed out right now, and, like, that's not a good thing. Does my makeup look so good right now, though? Yes, yes, it does. Honestly, I feel like this has been such a crazy week, and maybe that's like a good thing. Honestly, it really hasn't. Like, this week's been really chill. This morning, I went through and cleaned my entire house, and that made me feel so good. I felt so good. I love, I love it when I have the time to clean. That's my favorite. I'm gonna go in with my Care Bear blush from Went Wild. I love this blush because it's like, just like a really soft, but obnoxious pink, and I love that. It's really funny how into blushes I am now because I remember when I was younger, I did not believe in blush. Like when I was in middle school, I never wore blush because I like have really bad rosacea. Like I used to have really bad rosacea. Like nowadays, like it's under wraps, but like before. So like I would just cover everything with like foundation and then just like leave it like that, which is wild to think about now. Could never. My base, basic. I'm gonna go in with Morphe spray, just cause I'm like almost done, but not done. Well, I was gonna wear my Too Faced mascara today, but I I can't find it. So I'm gonna go with the Four Play primer and then my Kylash. I really love the Kylash, but lately, like the Too Faced natural mascara has been like one of my favorites, which is weird cause I don't usually change mascaras up this quick. Sometimes they just get like a death hold on me. I'm like, I can't, I need it. I really like this primer though, cause it has like a curved brush and it's also black. So I feel like it doesn't ruin like the wand and like my mascara. Cause most like primers are like white. And I just have this thing. Let me go in and put some glitter on this bad boy. This is a ColourPop in So Cute. I love that ColourPop makes like chunky glitters because not a lot of brands do and it's kind of hard to find, so it's really nice that they do. I love ColourPop. They're great. I'm just going to do a kind of a thin line today, just to make it look a little bit more like... People always are like, I love your highlight, and I'm like, thanks, it's glitter. But just to make it look a little bit more sharp. I'm actually allowed, because this one's kind of thick now, so I'm just going to thicken out the other one. 
glitter is everywhere. I have no idea what I want to wear for lipstick and honestly kind of crucial. I just went in with the Kylie lip liner. This is in shade Posey K and I really like this one. And then I think I'm going to go in with this one called Forever Curious from MAC. I like it, it just like feels a little too orange right now. And I'm gonna go over it with this It Cosmetics Confidence in a lip gloss. It's in self-determined. I really like these, the It Cosmetics one. It's the only color I have, but I really like them. We're gonna go in with Urban Decay Setting Spray and I'm gonna put on my outfit and we will be right back. Okay, I am at the point where I'm severely late. This is my outfit. It's this beautiful strawberry dress. I got from Hot Topic. I'm wearing it to a garden party. I'm so excited. I have a rave candy on, my jewelry, and yeah. I'll also switch out my lipstick for like a L'Oreal one. I'll put it in the description. I love you guys so much. If you enjoyed this like last minute get ready with me, leave a thumbs up and I love you and I will see you next week. Also, if I take any footage at this party, it'll be right after this. Bye!